those who dreamed about the Jewish state, those who survived the Holocaust and found in Israel the anchor, the security, those who wrought the historical miracle and against all odds established a state, those who stepped into the breach and defended the young Jewish state, so many of them paid with their lives, those who arrived in the homeland to their new home, those who propelled Israel forward step after step, those who stand at the technological vanguard and the loyal partners who ensure the continuation of the Zionist enterprise. All those are Karen Hayesod, because Karen Hayesod is Eretz Israel. For over 90 years, Karen Hayesod UIA has been involved in Israel's most important national priority operations. With your support and in full partnership with the government of Israel, we carry out so many tasks. During the next few minutes, together with my friends, Johanna, Yoki Arbiv Perugia, Chair of Keren Ayesod, World Board of Trustees, and Greg Meisel, Director General of Keren Ayesod, we'll see some of the most exciting places in Israel, where Keren Ayesod UIA is running high-profile projects. I'm here today at the Ibim Absorption Center to meet with the Director, Moshe Bahata, to learn about the final stages of how the absorption will take place in this village in a few weeks' time. הכרחי ודחוף גם למדינת ישראל. יש שם באמת משבר הומניטרי לא פשוט. ממשלת ישראל מבקשת להביא לפתרון הבעיה. בוקר טוב לכולם. היום אנחנו הולכים לקלוט כ-250 איש ישר לסדרות. נכין את הדירות, נסדר אותן, נסבע אותן, כדי שיוכלו העולים להיקלט בצורה הנכונה ביותר. סוף סוף אני הגעתי לבית שלי, לבית של אבותיי, לארץ שחלמתי עליה שנים רבות. במשך עשרות שנים אנו פועלים בכל רחבי תבל על מנת לשרת את צורכי העם היהודי ונרתמים לכל משימה שנועדה להביא את בני עמנו חזרה אל המולדת. of the Negev, one of Israel's greatest location, to tell you about Karen Esod achievements, to the growth, and to meet the challenges of our beloved state of Israel. The Negev, this huge reserve of land for development and colonization of the Jewish state, and those people need fields, houses, work. Help them to build their homeland. Go back to the land, to live on their own work, to be free and equal. That this is the way how to achieve this, not in the far future, but in their own life. If people ask me what is Ayalim, Ayalim is the Israeli dream. Young people work hard every morning for the country. I always wanted an experience like that, really living in an Israeli society, working the land and really getting in touch with Israel physically. The community that I found here and the idea that the work that I do actually makes a day-to-day -day difference in the future are the things that really impact me and the rest of the people that I live with here. In the end of the day, we say, hey, 
You understand that there is someone in Paris or in Roma or in London that care about us, realize our dream. It's amazing. I came here in August. There was a flag, there was a tent. Ayalim responded immediately to the need of housing. And six months later, 10 families are living here. I mean, this is, this is what Ayalim does. Just amazing to bring a baby to this home, to a place that people, that religious and non-religious live together and everyone helps each other all the time. It's the best home to bring her to. Modern Zionism at its best, integrating immigrant scientists into vital projects that secure Israel's qualitative edge in science and technology. The main is defense sweat on Israel today is Iran. To call in the open to the destruction of the state of Israel and in the same time developing a weapon that will enable them to do it. Global economy has been driven by energy. Energy is mainly sources are coming from oil. If you're pulling into a filling station, stop for just a second, turn the rear view mirror just a couple of inches so you're looking into your own eyes. Now you know who is paying for those little boys around the world to be taught to aspire to be suicide bombers. We've launched a 10-year program in Israel to kick the habit, to find a substitute for gasoline. And if we succeed, we can change the world, we can change history. Everybody knows that Israel is considered a startup nation for a reason, because it really is. And there's so much activity, both scientific, technological, and economic here, that this is an opportunity that really cannot be missed. It's the land that flows with milk and honey. Things here flow like nowhere else in the world. So what are our fuel cells? The car will go on a fuel, only the fuel is unusual. It's going to be hydrogen rather than gasoline. We've developed an energy-efficient transportation system. And we're going to be creating numerous science jobs. And by doing so, I think we're going to attract to Israel software specialists because this is a huge new industry. We have been cooperating with Karen Isod from the beginning. First project was Eric and Sheila Samson, a generous donation to the Prime Minister Prize for the most innovative contribution to this cause, and we are very grateful for that. Karen Isod UIA stands with the children of the periphery in projects that enhance their personal abilities and give them self-confidence and a better future. We are talking about more than uh, 10,000 uh, kids all over the country identify as uh, children at risk. They don't have the opportunity to develop, to have chance to go to the army, to finish high school, later on to function as a, a normal kid in the family. Part of the time they suffer from violence in the family or in the neighborhood. Your future is about empowering children to fulfill their potential. What is unique in, in, in your future program is, is that we put the child in the center and work to address all his need holistically. We give them the shelter, the individual shelter. We give them the chance to succeed in their daily life in the school and then to be just a normal, a good person in Israel, and that's great. I'm here today at the Hadassah Nu'urim Youth Village, a village designed to deal with children from disadvantaged homes, but don't come with disadvantaged minds. Our goal is to create a great deal of people to a more equitable society and to give a chance to every child and child. לחלום, לרצות ולהגשים. I came from Latvia. I was nine years old and uh, I came from broken family. 
and uh, only because of the people here and the help here in the Adasana Rim, I'm not the girl uh, in the street. I'm here and I have profession and I have family and I have child. Keren Esod UIA is always at the forefront of Israel's national priority tasks. With your support, what we do today is making a real change for so many. What we'll do in the future will cement these achievements. Because Keren Esod UIA is Eretz Israel.